Luke says they've actually stopped people getting down to the boat there because the boat must be full. I don't know what these uh, new Manly ferries hold, how many people, but I can tell you the old one used to hold about a thousand. So let's walk up through this uh, pier. It's busier than it has been on the last two occasions, or the last three occasions we've come up here. Aldi up uh, here towards the right but again I think uh, because of Covid that's uh, closed down you can come out of this pier or wharf or whatever you want to call it and we'll have a look how busy it is in uh, Manly today I'd imagine when it being Easter, it's uh, going to be absolutely packed. I always love it when you get here and you come out into this uh, beautiful area with the beautiful blue sky. And there's a map of uh, Manly Wharf. A lot of old buildings here in Manly as well which we'll uh, have a look at as we cross the road and head into Manly. So everybody's crossing here now, it's a busy road. I should imagine most of the people who are crossing are heading into the uh, wharf to uh, get the ferry back to Circular Quay in Sydney. Quite busy. Most of the uh, shops do look uh, open. As I say, it does look a lot busier than the last two uh, times we've been here. Plenty of people sitting on the seats, relaxing and chilling out. And there's plenty of people walking about with. Uh, ice creams and it is lovely and shady here as well so it's uh, keeping the sun off us the uh, buildings are like sheltering us we've got Coles local that is a food supermarket And look at the old buildings and all the palms, they look beautiful as we uh, walk down here today. We've got a shop there called Nab, don't know what they do. Been a little bit quieter here now, not quite as many people but there's still quite a few. We've got fish and chips. That's at Manly Seafoods. And then just in front of me, we've got the Manly Boat Shed. Uh, that's a pub where you go down some stairs and it's like underground. And they, they do a tremendous steak in there. We uh, have eaten in there many, many times. just coming up to a road which we will need to cross and across that road we've got an old brick church and it does look absolutely amazing so we have crossed over and we're now heading towards the beach we've got more shops more people Walking up eating ice cream, dogs walking, they are enjoying themselves and we've got more shops, chemists. Like right now, yeah. 
the children's play area there. And there was like a nice photo of the There is plenty for the children to do. Quite a big chemist there as well. We've got Humphreys' news agents. That is a news agent that's been here really as long as I can ever remember. I've been coming for the last 24 years and that has always been there. It looks like a lot of people have uh, come from the beach. They've probably been swimming or surfing. Another little dog there. And then we're coming here to more shops and the one we're looking at here uh, was Hungry Jack's. We have sat in that window there many times eating food. I'll be here as well, forgot to mention that to you on some of the last films where they've uh, got all these marquees or I don't know what else you call them, pergolas. There used to be a great big cafe right in the middle and we uh, did sit many a night in there eating steak or chicken but uh, I think just before Covid that did uh, back up so that's all gone but it looks today like we've had a market there so there is uh, quite a few market stalls Quite busy here at the uh, food oriented areas. There's uh, quite a lot of people here and they're all just sitting, eating. Uh, I suppose that's probably right because it is coming up to quarter to six, so it is uh, probably time to get something to eat. Here we are at the uh, beach. Let's uh, go check it out and see how busy it is today. Might have quietened down now because, as I say, it is coming up to quarter to six in the afternoon. But just looking at it, it does look as if it is still quite busy. I bet it's been packed today and it'll probably be even uh, busier tomorrow. So yeah, there is uh, a lot of people on the beach, all chilly, sunbathing, kids are making sandcastles, so I'd imagine earlier on, probably a couple of hours ago, it would have been a lot, lot busy day to day. I know I do keep repeating myself, but there isn't a cloud in the sky and it does make it look just absolutely phenomenal. Let's zoom in and just take a look at the water's edge. The waves are coming in. I uh, can't see many people surfing in there, there's just a couple of people swimming. But overall, very, very nice. And the sand is uh, lovely and soft, and you do sink into it as you're walking down there. So, as I say, we've got people just chilling, relaxing, we've got people sunbathing, people running, we've got plenty of seagulls flying about on the beach. They uh, probably after food where uh, people are dropping from when they're eating their food. And then if we look onto the board wharf here, again, it uh, does look lovely with all these spectacular trees and people are just relaxing, chilling, sitting and having a really, really good time. So we are going to 
that probably going to just try and get some tea now. Okay, I'm going to let you know It is uh, coming up to 10 to 6, so even though we had a nice dinner, we are getting hungry again now and ready for some uh, food. So we're going to head back now to the uh, ferry terminal. We uh, are losing daylight now. It's uh, half past six, so the uh, sun is down in about 20 minutes' time. And though it's, uh, it's half past six at night, it still is uh, very busy here in Manly. I don't know how busy it's going to be at the ferry terminal. Imagine it could be uh, quite busy there. So it looks like the uh, market stalls are all packing up now for today. I suppose they've had a very, very busy day. And just look uh, at the bar and the hotel across at the top. There's a lot of people drinking on the balcony. So all in all today we've had an absolutely uh, spectacular day again. We've uh, done some really good walking, got you some uh, real good footage again that we uh, will be putting out. Been a lovely day today and let's just have a look here at uh, all these beautiful old buildings as we uh, walk out of Manly. The uh, do look really, really good. Got these little fountains. They look uh, really nice as we come up this uh, course. Eh? Got the uh, play area. Another hotel there. And we've got plenty of water. It looks like somebody's left the tap running on the drink fountain there. Bottle shop, beers, wines and spirits. And we're coming now to the place where we've actually got the road. The Manly Pharmacy there, the uh, locks in a box. And it is quietening off here now, so like I say, I don't know what it'll be like at the ferry terminal, how busy that'll be. We'll find out as we uh, cross the road into it in a second. Got blush shoes, Manly jewellery. We've got a nice little sitting area there with the sunshade over it. And here in front of us we've got some amazing, spectacular trees. They look uh, absolutely wonderful. Don't know what ferry we'll catch. I'm hoping uh, it will be the big manly ferry. It would be uh, really good if it was. Yeah. What is so eggplant? That's what we're just coming now to the big main road that we uh, need to cross. And as we uh, cross over, we'll uh, walk into the Manly Wharf and see what time the ferry's going. I should imagine when we get back into Sydney, the sun will be completely down, it'll be dark. Look how beautiful it looks there with the colour of the sun setting by the uh, trees and over the uh, Manly Ferry Terminal. There's really a really, really nice area here. And there you are, 
we are zoomed into the ferry terminal and it does look quite busy. So there did used to be a McDonald's here where we uh, did on many occasions get an ice cream but uh, unfortunately that is closed now. So let's head into the ferry terminal now and catch the ferry back to Circular Quay. Very uh, busy here on the ferry terminal again tonight. So I should imagine the uh, ferry back is uh, going to be quite packed. So here we go. We're getting back on the Manly Fast Ferry to uh, Circular Quay. The beach there at Manly. It does look absolutely spectacular as it goes dark. 